I'm Simon and welcome back to the Shoreview Lab. Last year we published a short blog about how to create a QR code as a quick and easy way for people to report security events into your command center. It created a lot of interest, so we thought we'd show an example of how to set this up in the lab. The general idea was to create a sign with a QR code that could be placed anywhere on your building or facilities that would provide a quick and familiar way that anyone could report something to the SOC reinforcing the basic security idea of see something, say something. For this example, we're gonna have our QR code send an email to the SOC that will be received by Shoreview and transformed into an alarm. First, create the alarm in Shoreview. Go to alarms and add a new alarm. Let's call our alarm public security report. Assign it to an area, associate an action plan and give it a priority. Then, let's copy the email address given to us by Shoreview to use it in our new QR code. Now let's jump over to a QR program. There are many of these online. We use one called QR Code Monkey, but any service will work. We're going to select email as our option and then paste in the email address given to us by Shoreview Response. Give it a subject like need assistance and add a message. We can also add the GPS coordinates of where this sign is located for accurate location data. Then generate your code. This will create a unique QR code that has all this information embedded into the message. To test it out, scan the code from your phone. This will open a new email message containing the information you embedded in the QR code. You can even attach a photo or video to provide additional context. This message will instantly be received as an alarm in Shoreview so operators can take action. It really is that easy. Print out a different QR code for different areas so that your team knows exactly where these events are being triggered. In just a couple of minutes, you've created a really simple way for anyone to quickly get in contact with your command center. Check out the other videos in this series and subscribe below to stay up to date with the latest from Shoreview.